Join us for a dim sum fest at one of the best dim sum restaurant chains in Hong Kong. Dim Dim Sum. Our signature dim sum is over here. With soy, chili. Mmm. That was just done so immaculately. Inside wrap is like a very thin lumpia wrapper. Just so crispy. And then you have the steamed rice roll on top. Plus tons of shrimp. Wow. That is a must order dish over here. This restaurant has been featured in Newsweek's 101 Best Places to Eat in the World. There are three branches in Hong Kong, and they have since expanded internationally to Shanghai, South Korea, and Taiwan. Lucky for us, there is a dim dim sum branch very close to our hotel in Mong Kok. Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel. We just arrived at Dim Dim Sum. This was named one of the best 101 restaurants in the world by Newsweek in 2012. And we can't wait to try out their dim sum. You guys ready? Dim sum translates literally to touch of the heart and is used to represent a large range of small Cantonese dishes that are traditionally enjoyed in restaurants for brunch with tea. From their menu, we would highly recommend every single dish we ordered, including the crispy rice flour rolls with shrimp, shrimp and pork dumplings with flying fish roe, shaolong bao, steamed shrimp dumplings, blanched choy sum, and rice flour rolls with barbecue pork and zucchini. Such a nice crunch on it. I love choy sum just because it's so dense and you know it's really has tons of fiber and so good for you. But it just tastes fantastic as well. Up next, the shrimp and pork dumpling with flying fish roe. This is known in the Philippines as shomai. I think that's one of the Filipinos' favorite kind of dim sum. Dip it in a little bit of soy sauce. Oh, this looks so good. That's the best shomai I've ever seen in my life. Mm. That was hot. I really love their texture of their shomai. And that flying fish roll on top adds some nice uh, texture to that shomai. That's definitely the best shomai I've ever eaten. Now it's time for their shalom bao. This is actually quite a big, huge shalom bao. Take a bite out of this first. Oh, soup is just all coming out. Oh wow, soupy, savory, and look at that, tons of meat inside. For a giant shalom bao, it's actually quite tasty. Wrap is a little bit on the thick side, but wow, that is delicious. Cheers. Mm. I super enjoyed their hakao. Perfect translucent rice flour wrap. And wow, uh, you really taste the flavor of that shrimp. There's like maybe a few pieces of shrimp inside. They're medium sized, just wonderful. Up next is the crispy rice flour roll with shrimp. Just quite a pleasant surprise. I think this is one of their signature dim sums over here with soy, chili. Mm. That was just done so immaculately. The inner inside wrap is like a very thin lumpia wrapper. Just so crispy and then you have the steamed rice roll on top plus tons of shrimp. Wow, that is a must order dish over here. Rice flour rolls with barbecue pork and zucchini. Next, the rice flour rolls with barbecue pork and zucchini. Mm. Almost got away. Mm. Flavor of that barbecue pork really comes out. Super tender. A little bit of flavor from the zucchini. But really their signature roll. It's lovely. The crispy shrimp rice roll. 
that was an exceptional dim sum feast. I particularly enjoyed the cacao, just the steamed shrimp dumplings, as well as the shrimp and pork dumplings with flying fish roll and the choy sum vegetable, crispy rice roll with shrimp. Ah, can't forget about that xiao lung bao. What is your favorite? I think this was an egg meal. Yeah. Shalom bao was like, I like this one so good. It's a flavorful, it's good. And all the rice rolls also was great taste. How about you, Alexandra? What was your favorite? My favorite was the shalom bao and the you know, hakao. It was just, you know, one of the best. I've tried uh, nothing I've ever tried before. I highly recommend this one. Well, there you have it. Thanks for watching, guys. Please stay safe. We'll see you in the next episode. Now we're back at Moko, one of the biggest malls in Mongkok, which is connected to the hotel we're staying at. Royal Plaza. Alexander wanted some gelato before going back to the hotel. The mall closes at 10 p.m. So we are at Mamma Mia Gelato here at the Moko Mall. Ooh, I